Welcome back to Daytime. We're now going to talk about fall jewelry trends. Please help me welcome Kelly Canary. Thank you so much for being here. Thanks for having me. I'm so excited. Oh, I love your hair. I love what you're wearing. Thank you. Thank you. So what's in right now in terms of jewelry for fall? There's lots that's in. Yeah. Um, obviously, uh, lots of fall colors, uh, chunky necklaces are chunky. back, bib necklaces. Um, any any earrings. mixing of the, uh, of the medium, so leather, chain, stones, semi-precious stones, crystals, really, I mean, really? It, it crosses are uh, in again, just like the 80s, pearls. The 80s are back? Uh, <laughs> I swear, <laughs> pearls, pearls are back with a vengeance, uh, thanks to the Great Gatsby movie in the summertime, yes. so lots of pearls, long necklaces with you know, embellishments and, and stones mm -hmm. and uh, there's so much. I mean, really, it's 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 what the, the individual what likes. Like anything goes kind of thing? Anything goes, but there are trends. I mean, certainly chunky, a lot of color. Like, look at your, okay, so that's what you mean by chunky, what you're wearing there in terms this of. This is a chunkier bracelet for sure. Like a class. Um, and, and yellow gold is, really? is, is back. Again, that was the 80s. I mean, people have been getting rid of their gold jewelry. Yeah. Gold is back. back. Gold with color. So whereas mm. white gold and silver was, was, has been, you know, trendy for, for so many years, mm -hmm. gold is back. Okay. So. And I'm noticing the big earrings yes. that's in too now. Yes. Because before they were very small. The bigger the better. But now bigger the better. Yes. It doesn't matter what kind of face you have. If you've got like a wider face, I mean, you've got a sleek face, so it's okay. Oh, thank you. Yeah, but if you had a, maybe a wider face, is that still okay if you want to follow the trend? Well, it, depend, like, it, it, it depends on your neckline or two. It depends on what you're wearing. Mm. Um, you know, okay. a lot of people tend to stay away from bigger earrings, but, uh, you know, really anyone can wear it. It just okay. depends on what you're wearing. Now, you brought in eight models. I did. And you're going to show us how to wear jewelry according to the neckline. So who's our first model? This is <gasps> Eddie. Ooh, she looks elegant. And she's, uh, she's got my Audrey Hepburn look here today, kind of like the great Gatsby inspiration from the movie. Mm -hmm. so she's got a beautiful black lace dress, and we've embellished it with, uh, with the pearls and the asymmetrical crystal flower. And then she's got a beautiful bracelet. And uh, so she has obviously the the smaller earrings. She's got the smaller but the earrings. big necklace. Exactly. Is so that what you want to do? You don't want to take away from a statement piece. I'm very um, a, a true believer of making a statement with one particular piece. You can match it up or, or layer, but you don't want to take away from whether it's a big chunky ring or a big chunky necklace or. Um, okay. It, it flows nice together. So find your but focal point. Had we had big earrings, it would have taken away mm. from the necklace. But so I like beautiful. how. The necklace, see that clasp, matches the ring that she's got. Absolutely. You did that on purpose, obviously. Yes. So yes. you want to do that, sort of have something that coordinates also? Yes. Okay. But not too much. So it does, I mean, because the flower is the focal point, mm -hmm. you know, you got the, the ring, it does, it flows nice together. Okay. I love that. Thank you so much, Audrey Hepburn. <laughs> Very sleek. Oh, this is lovely. You can wear this. Anywhere, really. So, so, she, so she's she's got the, the cowl, uh, or you know, the 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 cowl neck, and she's got a beautiful blazer on, mm -hmm. um, more of a, uh, you know, a, a comfortable look. So, what I've done here, um, because the, the neckline is lower, is we've put uh, a nice pendant uh, to bring out the green in the shirt. Mm -hmm. um, that is a semi-precious stone called fuchsite. Um, it's wire wrapped, and then we've layered. I was going to say you've layered we've the layered, necklace. We've layered the necklace. So she's actually wearing three different necklaces. So layering is something that um, you can do and play with. A lot of people don't realize that, you know, put some elements to it. You can mm -hmm. maybe wear a stone necklace and then a plain chain or, you know, add pearls to it. So ah. layering really has a nice effect. So you could wear pearls with this? Absolutely. So One strand of pearls I might put in the middle. Uh, maybe in, a, in an earth tone, mm -hmm. um, along with the chain. So mixing of mediums, like I said, it, it really it, it has a nice effect. Now, noticing that you've got the green that kind of picks up off of the top, but could you right. maybe color block and use you, a different absolutely. color? Absolutely, you could use a different color. You could still go with the navies. You could go with black. You could go with um, any of the burgundies. Mm -hmm. oh, that's beautiful. So any of the fall colors. Thank you, my dearest. That was lovely. Thank you so much, Shelley. Oh, I like the sparkle. Yes, the lovely Suzanne. She's wearing a V-neck, mm -hmm. so um, and a beautiful bright fuchsia sweater. So I didn't want to take away from from the sweater, but bring out the 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 the, the sparkle in the jewelry. Mm. So she's wearing a V-neck with uh, a three-stranded hematite 
uh, necklace. Mm -hmm. uh, again, now simpler earrings. So I've added the, the hematite also in the earrings, but okay. a bit of a drop. So it's not too chunky. Right. Again, not taking away from the necklace. That's that's a delicate balance. Yes. It's, it's a very <laughs> interesting delicate, how you did that. Yes, it's a delicate balance. Now you could wear a chunkier necklace with with the V-neck, but could I just you? Yeah, you could. Um, I really like the simplicity of it though. Mm -hmm. Especially when she's got the bright sweater on. Mm -hmm. So it really brings it out. Could you wear pearls with this outfit? Absolutely. Okay. Absolutely. And have some fun with that. Yes. Um, and I, the sparkle I've noticed is is very in again. Yes. It kind of Came well, back. When you, and especially leading into the holiday season too. Oh yes. So fall is a great uh, is a great time to start bringing bringing sparkle back into your into your jewelry and into the wardrobe, mm -hmm. and then leading into the the holiday season. That's right. And she's not wearing anything on her arm. She does have a ring. A oh, ring. There she's you go. She's got a ring that is um, a rectangular shape and also has chunks of hematite in it. That's gorgeous. Thank you so much. I love that ring. That's beautiful. Thank you, Suzanne. Thank you, Suzanne. Now, if you were um, some some women who are you know bigger breasted don't want to wear a chunky necklace. Is that do you agree with that yeah, or I, no? I, simpler is, is is better for sure, or something long, long. But just and simple, right? And maybe a pendant down. I like that. So who do we have here? This is Tracy. This is interesting. And Tracy is also wearing a V-neck. Now this is where I've shown again uh, la uh, elements of layering the the uh, jewelry. So she does have two different necklaces on. Um, the first one is a shorter sterling silver necklace with hematite. Mm -hmm. And so she could really get away with wearing a shorter necklace or a longer necklace or both. Because so of the neckline? Versatile. Yeah. So, and because the, 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 the top is longer, mm -hmm. um, the, the longer necklace elongates it a, a little more. Oh, so if you want to look longer, do I you like wear the long? longer? The longer necklaces, absolutely. Okay. And beautiful ring picks up very nicely with what she's wearing. So again, she's wearing gray, you know, muted tones, but then she's got, you know, the different shapes going on in the necklace. Um, there's some crystal elements to it. Silver's back in, or actually that has really? never really left, has it? it and, and another, another um, trend is mixing of the metals. So you can really? see, you know, rose gold with gold with silver. So mixing of metals also is very trendy. Really? Yes. I like that. Thank you so much. That's lovely. Thanks, Tracy. <gasps> this next one I find so elegant, dainty. Now Sarah is wearing a beautiful blue dress with a V-neck. And this necklace actually wraps around the front. It does up in the front. It's mm -hmm. on a toggle. And nice sparkly, just plain sterling silver uh, necklace. And it just drops nice into the breast line. Mm -hmm. And then again, the earrings, they are, there is a simple drop with uh, sterling silver <gasps> balls, but it lo it, it's nice with the jawline. Yes. And again, um, flows well with, with the whole outfit. See, she has a beautiful face that can wear the longer earrings. Yes. I yes. like that a lot. Very lovely. And then she's uh, got a beautiful sterling silver ring on as well. Gorgeous. Thank you so much. Thank you, Sarah. I think we have three more models left. Yes. Here we go. I love the hair. How did you make this pop? This blue. is Lanta. This blue is actually uh, very, um, very trendy and, and fashionable right now. A lot of designers have used that, that vibrant blue in purses and mm -hmm. accessories and shoes. She's mm -hmm. got beautiful, vibrant blue shoes mm. on. So I, I popped, um, I wanted the, the blue to pop uh, from this dress. I made a um, triple stranded lapis lazuli, which is a semi-precious stone and sterling silver necklace that really, again, chunky, but brings up Great the blue shoes. in the dress. Love it. Along with the layering of the bracelets with and I the, love her the hair. similar colors and the ring also. Beautiful. Thank you so much. Thanks, Yolanta. This is, you can wear this out or at work. Absolutely. Yes. What is she wearing? So Liz is wearing a, uh, a longer, because her, she's got a, a half uh, sweater love on, an animal print. Feathers also, you'll see a lot of mm -hmm. uh, jewelry with feathers. Um, they could be earrings or, uh, you know. Seen them in earrings. Absolutely, or, or a piece to uh, the necklace. It's gorgeous. But because she's got a half sweater on, you wouldn't want a shorter necklace. You want, again, to elongate. Long. That's right. So okay. it looks beautiful. Um, it just brings out, you know, the animal print a little more. She's got Casual matching. but chic. Yes, and she's got the drop earrings. Great. And the beautiful black uh, bracelet. Love it. Thank you. I think that's probably one of my favorites so very far. Chic. Mm -hmm. Thank very you, chic. Very <gasps> chic. I love the sparkly. And this is Danielle. Just really quickly, what is she wearing? So Danielle's wearing a nice casual black outfit. You can go out with your girlfriends. And she is wearing a uh, silver 
and black agate, uh, chunkier necklace. Agate. Agate, Never which is a semi-precious stone, okay. yes. And then she's wearing a leather bracelet. Mm -hmm. Now crosses, you'll see elements of, of crosses and jewelry as well. Yes, Either I've noticed that. A lot of crosses, so I've added the, the sparkly cross onto the black leather. Picks up very well. Yes. Okay, thank you so much, my dear. That's awesome. Now you're sticking around. What are we gonna do after the break? Well, we're going to have the same models come out with different outfits mm. and uh, different pieces of jewelry, and mm -hmm. we'll talk about mixing of metals and... And how to do all of that. Absolutely. Okay, thank excited. you so much. So thank please you. come on back. We are learning what's in for fall in terms of jewelry, but also how to wear them well. So please come on back. with Kelly Canary of Mon Petit Bijou. For more information, call 416-996-0634 or visit monpetitbijou.com.